how to add contact form 7 responses to salesforce as contact automatically so if you also want to sync your form builder data with salesforce crm then this video is for you because what will happen here whenever the form submission is received in contact form 7 i will show you how instantly and automatically you can create that person as a contact in salesforce application in this way you do not have to manually export the data again and again and import it here in order to send any kind of email from salesforce to your form submitters want to learn how you can also do that then come with me and i will show you everything step by step so this is the contact form 7 application where I have created and embedded this form into one of my page and this is the preview of that page. The form name is inquiry form for interior designing service and this is the dashboard of Salesforce where you can notice only one contact is available. Now in front of you I will submit this form with some dummy details and you will see how the same person will be created as a contact here but to automate this first I will have to build an integration basically a connection in contact form 7 application and in salesforce application which i am going to do with the help of pabli connect which is an amazing and a very cost effective integration and automation software i am an existing user of pabli connect so i am already logged in but you can create your free account in pabli connect in just two minutes from the sign up free button and in the free account you will also get free tasks to test these kind of amazing automation okay so once you will log in and reach out to the dash Dashboard, firstly click on this blue button that is create workflow and then provide a random name to your workflow to your automation okay so i am providing the name something like saying contact form 7 responses with the salesforce okay so i have provided this name now simply click on create and then you will find two boxes okay so these boxes are called as trigger an action and here the trigger means when this happens an action means do this so when something happen in the first application then automatically do this in the next application okay so this is how you need to select the applications in this trigger and the action window in which you are building an automation okay so according to our use case we want that whenever any new form submission is made in this contact form 7 plugin or we can say an application then automatically add the same response as a contact in our salesforce application okay so i have selected both the applications in this trigger and the action window okay and now the idea here is firstly i will connect contact form 7 with the capably connect and capture the form submission data and then further i will send the same submission data to different application or to salesforce application okay so this is how this automation will take place and here you can notice as soon as i have selected the trigger even it has provided me a webhook url and few set of instructions okay so you will have to follow these instructions carefully okay and with the help of the url only we are going to build the connection okay so firstly we will copy this webhook url and paste it into our contact form 7 okay and here you will notice as soon as i have copied this url it has already started waiting for the response okay so read the instruction that install and activate this contact form 7 plugin from the plugin section on the wordpress dashboard okay so this is the plugin which you have to firstly download and upload in your wordpress website okay so this is the plugin section of my wordpress website you will have to click on this add new button then further you will have to click on this upload plugin button okay this is the upload plugin button and here exactly you can download basically you can upload the zip file which you will download from here but i'll show you the installed section of plugin okay basically installed plugin section of my wordpress website because this plugin is already installed in my wordpress website okay i'll copy this name and paste it here and you will notice that the same plugin is already installed and even activated okay so because this plugin is already activated this webhook option is already available here in my form okay so this is my form firstly i'll edit this form in front of you and you will notice a webhook option along with this form okay 
So this is the webhook option and if I will deactivate this plugin, you will notice that the same option will be disappear from here. Okay, so where is the option and here you can notice. Let me first refresh it. Okay, and here you can notice that option has been disappeared from here. So that is why it is important to activate this plugin because we will have to copy this webhook URL and paste in our form. Okay, so let me paste the same. Firstly, I will refresh it and here you can find the webhook option once again okay so here you can notice one URL is already added so firstly I have replaced I have deleted that URL and have pasted that new webhook URL which I have just got from Pabli connect okay and now I will save this form okay now I'll save this option but before that make sure you also tick mark this checkbox okay so clicking on save and after that I will submit this form okay so let me first close this plugin section and and now I will submit this form in front of you with some dummy data and as soon as I do that you will see how the details will be captured via public connect okay so let me show you how about I keep the first name something like demo user okay asking for the email address so again I will provide some dummy email address only that is demo user 123 at publicutes.com okay and again telling you this is just a random details just a dummy email address okay let me also add a 10 digit phone number and again this is a dummy number asking for your message and what you would like us to design okay so i would like to design my salon okay so i will add the same i would okay like to design my salon okay so i have also added the message now i will submit this form going back to my public connected dashboard and here you can notice as soon as i have submitted that form the details of that form has been captured as a response okay and these are the same details that is the same name which i have provided at the time of form submission this is the same message that is i would like to design my salon this is the same email address the same choice basically salon and and this is the same dummy phone number okay so the presence of this data clearly shows that the connection in between our contact form and public connect is working absolutely fine okay so now onwards what will happen every time a new form submission is made in that form the details will be captured via public connect instantly because this trigger will instantly capture new incoming data and the workflow execution will start in real time okay so in this way the first step of our automation is completed now moving further i will send this form submission data to different application or to my salesforce crm application in place of salesforce you can also send the same form submission data to different crm okay so like let's say you want to send it to active campaign or mailchimp you can select your favorite crm application okay currently i'll go with the same that is salesforce okay so i have selected the same and just like firstly we have connected contact form 7 plugin with pabli connect now i will be connecting salesforce and pabli connect but firstly i I will select the action event that is create a contact because I would like to perform the same simply click on this connect button simply clicking on add new connection simply clicking on connect with Salesforce and because I am already logged in in my Salesforce account in a different app so it is asking me for the permission instead of asking me for the access and I have applied I have basically provided the authorization is successful and my Salesforce account is also connected with the public connect okay and now it will ask you lot of other details which are actually required for creating a contact in salesforce okay but i will provide the data only into the required or into the mandatory fields like first it is asking for the last name okay so you tell me from where i will provide these details okay so remember we have already captured the data as a response of our first step so i'm going to provide this data only and the interesting thing here is i am not going to manually copy the data and paste here one by one okay i am going to map this data okay and mapping is very simple when you will click on this field you will find the above data here in the drop down okay so let's say it is asking for the first name and the last name but the interesting twist here is we have captured the name as the full name we have not added the first name and last name field individually in our form okay 
सो इट इज अ स्मॉल टिप दैट यू कैन डू द सेम वाइल क्रिएटिंग द फॉर्म बेसिकली यू कैन एड इंडिविजुअल फील्ड इन योर फॉर्म्स ओके करेंटली आई गो विद द सेम इवन इन द फर्स्ट नेम आई विल प्रोवाइड द सेम वैल्यू एंड इवन इन द लास्ट नेम आई गो विद द सेम वैल्यू ओके बिकॉज माई पर्पज इज जस्ट टू शो यू हाउ कनेक्शन कैन बी मेड और हाउ ऑटोमेशन कैन बी क्रिएटेड सो आई एम ऑलरेडी शोइंग यू दिस ओके द डिटेल्स आर अप टू यू आस्किंग फॉर अदर स्ट्रीट अदर सिटी अदर कंट्री वेल रिमेंबर आई हैव नॉट कैप्चर्ड एनी सच डिटेल्स फ्रॉम माई फॉर्म सो आई विल लीव ऑल दीज फील्ड ब्लैंक आई जस्ट प्रोवाइड द डेटा आई विल जस्ट प्रोवाइड द डेटा इन दिस मोबाइल नंबर फील्ड एंड फाइनली इन द ई मेल फील्ड ओके नाउ यू मस्ट बी थिंकिंग दैट वॉट इज दिस मैपिंग विच आई एम डूइंग हेयर ओके सो वॉट एवर द डिटेल्स यू विल मैप हेयर दीज डिटेल्स विल बी रिप्लेसड ऑटोमेटिकली वेन दिस ऑटोमेशन विल वर्क इन रियल टाइम ओके एंड जस्ट इन केस इफ यू विल प्रोवाइड एनी डेटा मैनुअली दैट डेटा विल रिमेन सेम विद एवरी फॉर्म सबमिशन ओके सो दिस इज द डिफरेंस इन प्रोवाइडिंग द वैल्यूज वाया मैपिंग और वाया मैनुअली ओके सो आई थिंक आई हैव प्रोवाइडेड द डेटा इन ऑल द फील्ड नाउ हाउ अबाउट आई क्लिक ऑन दिस बटन एंड एज सुन एज द रिस्पॉन्स इज रिसीव एंड इफ दैट रिस्पॉन्स इज पॉजिटिव विच मीन्स द डेटा द कॉन्टैक्ट हैज बीन क्रिएटेड इन माई सेल्स फोर्स एप्लीकेशन ओके सो लेट मी रिफ्रेश माई सेल्स फोर्स डैशबोर्ड एंड वेट फॉर द कॉन्टैक्ट टू बी क्रिएटेड एंड हेयर यू कैन नोटिस द कॉन्टैक्ट इज ऑलरेडी क्रिएटेड एंड रिमेंबर वी हैव एडेड द फर्स्ट नेम एंड लास्ट नेम एज डेमो यूजर एंड डेमो यूजर ओनली सो दैट इज वाई द सेम डिटेल्स हैव बीन अपडेटेड इन द फर्स्ट नेम फील्ड एंड इन प्लेस ऑफ द लास्ट नेम फील्ड हेयर वी ऑल्सो हैव द फोन नंबर एंड द ई मेल एड्रेस एंड द मॉडिफाइड डेट ओके सो द प्रेजेंस ऑफ दिस डेटा क्लियरली शोज दैट आर ऑटोमेशन इज वर्किंग एब्सोलूटली फाइन ओके सो नाउ ऑन वर्ड्स वट विल हैपन एवरी टाइम एनी न्यू फॉर्म सबमिशन इज मेड इन कॉन्टैक्ट फॉर्म सेवन द सेम पर्सन विल बी क्रिएटेड एज ए कॉन्टैक्ट ऑटोमेटिकली इन सेल्स फोर्स एंड टू ऑटोमेट दिस प्रोसेस यू नीड टू क्रिएट दिस ऑटोमेशन इन साइड पब्लिक कनेक्ट फॉर वंस आफ्टर दैट यू कैन सिट बैक एंड रिलैक्स बिकॉज पैब्लिक कनेक्ट विल टेक केयर ऑफ ऑल द टास्क इन द बैक एंड ओके एंड जस्ट इन केस इफ यू वॉन्ट टू एक्सेस दिस टू स्टेप ऑटोमेशन टू स्टेप वर्क फ्लो इन साइड योर पैब्लिक कनेक्ट अकाउंट आई विल ऑल्सो अटैच द लिंक ऑफ माई वर्क फ्लो इन टू द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स सो सिंपली क्लिक ऑन दिस लिंक एंड देन साइन अप फॉर फ्री इन टू द पैब्लिक कनेक्ट एंड देन यू विल बी एबल टू एक्सेस द सेम वर्क फ्लो इन साइड योर ओन पैब्लिक कनेक्ट अकाउंट दैट टू फॉर फ्री Not just these applications, you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with Pabli Connect. You can ask your queries at forum. Pabli. com. My team will surely answer to your questions. This is the website of Pabli Connect, and for the latest updates of Pabli Connect and unique automation ideas, you can join our Facebook group that is Formget. Deals. If you have found this video helpful in any way, share it with your friends and colleagues, and also help them to automate their business. Like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching this video.